In the last 30 days, this YouTube channel made $46,000 just by uploading kids' animation videos. Let's look at another channel. This channel was created in 2018, and it has since gained millions of views along with 1.66 million subscribers. This channel is making $62,000 per month. In this video, I will teach you how to create similar kids' animation videos without any hurdles. This video will be broken down into three steps. Script writing. Voiceover. Video editing. Before we start, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so and check out my other videos as well. Let's begin. Step 1. Script writing. For script writing, we'll be using ChatGPT. We'll paste our prompts into the command section. Making friends by being nice to people, the characters should be farm animals, only three characters and that takes places in one scene background, keep in mind, we'll ask for everything that can make our story engaging. For instance, if our story includes animals, we'll focus on animal characters. ChatGPT has provided us with this story, which includes three characters, Charlie the chicken, Benny the bunny, Molly the moo cow, and one narrator. Our script is ready. Step 2, voiceover. For the voiceover, we'll use Well Said Labs. The link will be available in the description. Open Well Said Labs and click on New Project. I'll name it Animation. Since we have three characters, we need three different voices, one for Charlie, one for Benny, one for Molly, and another for the narrator. Let's start with Charlie. Click here, listen to different voices, and choose the one that fits best. Now, select it. Copy Charlie's lines, paste them here in the description section, and click on Generate. It may take some time to generate. Once it's done, listen to it. We'll repeat the process for all of Charlie's lines. At the end, all of Charlie's lines will be ready. To download them, click here. All of Charlie's lines have been downloaded. I'll rename them for better organization. I'll create a folder named Chicken and move all the audio files there. Now, it's time for Benny. I'll select another voice for Benny, as we need different voices for different characters. I'll paste Benny's lines here in the description and click Generate. Benny's voice is ready for one line. We'll do this for all of Benny's lines, download them, rename them, and create a folder for Benny's audio. Next, it's time for Molly the cow. I'll select a different voice, generate the audio, and download it. I'll move all of Molly's audios to her folder. Finally, we need a voice for the narrator. Let's select a different voice. Paste the script here, click Generate, and download it. Move it to the narrator's folder, and our voiceover is fully ready. Oh no! You haven't subscribed to my channel yet? What are you waiting for? Do it now because I appreciate all of you. Step 3, Video Editing. Now, we're on the final stage, Video Editing. This time, we'll be using Canva for video editing. The Canva link will be available in the description. Open Canva and click on Video. It will open another tab. Look at our script, it has the same scene, a farmland. We'll click on Canva Elements and type Farmland. Click on Graphics, scroll down, and choose the one that looks good. Click to add it. The background looks a bit plain. We need to add some animation. But how? First, click on Share, then click on Download and download it in JPG format. To animate it, we'll use Immersity AI. Click on Upload, upload the image, and click on Animate. Then, click on Export. It will take some time to process. Once it's done, click on Download. Look at the difference now. Now, open Canva again, click on Upload, and upload the newly generated animated video. Click to add it. Now see the difference. Next, we'll add elements according to the script. In our script, the first character is a chicken. We'll type chicken, click on graphics, and choose the one that looks good. I'll adjust and drag it to where it needs to be. To animate it, click on it. The animate button will appear. Then, click on animate and create the animation. Move it in the direction where the animation is needed. Look at how good it is, it looks like the chicken is walking. I'll add the chicken's audio here. Now, listen. For the second scene, I'll duplicate the background. In this scene, Bunny appears. I'll search for a bunny and add it here. In this scene, the chicken is asking Bunny something, so I'll try to make it look like the chicken is moving toward Bunny and asking it. I'll add the scene's audio as well. Now listen. For the third scene, I'll duplicate the background again. This time, Bunny is talking to the chicken. I'll animate this clip accordingly and add the voiceover for that scene. We're missing one thing, the background music. For this, I'll use Pixabay. I'll click on Music, type in the kind of music I want, and click Play. This one sounds good. I'll download it, go back to Canva, upload the music, and add it to the layers. I'll adjust the volume so that it's easy to hear the main content rather than the background music being too loud. 
Finally, our video is ready. I'll click on share, then download. What a beautiful day. I wonder what I can do today. Hi, Benny. What are you doing all by yourself? Wow, I've never had so many friends before. Thank you, Charlie, for being so kind. I hope you liked this content. I'm sure you've subscribed to my channel by now. If not, why?